Right, today I'm going to show you how to make this LED flashlight and plasma torch combo or you can call it a taser gun and turn on the flashlight here there we go or you can call it a um, spark generator so basically this is just a high voltage generator uh, powered just by a single 18650 battery I call this a lightning generator because look at this it looks like lightning it sounds like lightning and it has a lot of uses you can use it as a flashlight. Flashlight is pretty bright. I'm in the bathroom now. And flashlight is on. Off. On. You can use it as a igniter for propane canister. You can use it for cooking. Alcohol stove. Or you can launch a rocket, get a water bottle. Clean some alcohol. Check it real good. Yeah. Put it here like so. Ready? Let me show you the spark generator by this spark generator. Why go in here out over there? Pretty cool, isn't it? And of course I can also use this for self-defense or self-protection. The look and the sound of the uh, spark is scary enough to deter any animal or predator or even human and needless to say if you get shocked by one of these it's gonna be really unpleasant so I bought this item from eBay for one dollar seventy eight cents and it's called the uh, DC boost step up power module or high voltage generator and uh, it boosts the voltage from 3.6 volt DC to 400,000 volts and uh, the input can be from 3.6 volt to 6 volt DC so you can put in a single 18650 or two 18650 in series let me show you how it works so we got a green wire and a red wire on this end a couple wires on this end and these are the same color so on this end here is a DC input 3.6 volts to 6 volts DC input this end here is the output which is about 400,000 volts and all you got to do alright the capacitor is charged you can see 
but uh, the distance between the two uh, n is too wide so I'm gonna get I'm gonna get it a little bit closer okay Let's see if that works as you can see let me turn off the light Let's see it better let's try again And if I get it a bit closer, it will be a lot more uh, explosive, even louder. Sound like a bomb. Right, so here are the parts that I'm going to need for this project. The voltage generator, the battery holder. I only need single, so you can fit into the uh, PVC tube here. But I only have this, so... I think I'm gonna cut it out to only use a single like that. That way I can easily uh, insert and remove the battery when I need to replace the battery. Very quick and easy. Uh, I need another switch for the light, which I already glued an LED onto the top of the uh, generator here and a one inch PVC electrical conduit and a cap to cap it off
I think I'm done here. Got my uh, clue to glue this piece together also on the bottom. And this switch here for the LED light is is independent with this switch. So um, and then so I can turn on the LED or uh, I can use this with the LED on at the same time or with the LED off and also uh, this double switch is for safety because if you only press one button it doesn't work the only way for it to work is to press both buttons at the same time let me get closer a little bit press both buttons at the same time okay that's the only way that it works and it doesn't matter if LED is, is on or off it still works the high voltage generator okay so um, let me turn this off here let me show you the circuit very rough sketch of my circuit it's a very simple circuit so here's a battery okay so the uh, high voltage generator and the LED connected in parallel each with its own switch so this is the double switch for the generator the LED has its own switch I forgot to draw a switch so the switch for the LED is on the bottom okay so that's a switch for the LED it's on the bottom right here LED go here and go to the positive terminal this double switch will also go to the positive terminal or the negative terminal will go to the generator and to the LED okay and also I install the um, resistor here it's a 3 ohm resistor uh, I don't have to install a resistor but I want to extend the life of my LED so um, you know, just to be safe so it can last longer also so the resistor is right here okay and that is pretty much it 